I'm most proud of the people of Frederick. We are Maryland's second largest city, but still very much have a kind of small town charm. In our residents, the diversity and the mix of residents, when you ask them to step forward to do things, they really are engaged in the community, and it's a really great place to walk around and talk to people, and that friendliness is something that I'm really proud of. I would say a word that describes Frederick is vibrant. We have a diverse business mix, a diverse cultural mix, a diverse neighborhood mix, and that vibrancy, that eclectic nature, I think really makes Frederick an interesting place to live, and it's an attractive place for people to want to visit and, and work in as well. And I think, that's a, I think that's a really strong character trait. I would say business in Frederick is really strong and getting stronger. We continue to see an expansion of what we're doing well and adding every day to the diversity of our business climate and that's something that we look forward to continuing to do. So Frederick is a strong community, strong business community and getting stronger. Hi, I'm John Miller, the Burgess of Middletown and um, very proud to be uh, the Burgess of our town. It is a, there's a lot to be proud of in our town of Middletown and one of the things I'm most proud of is the fact that we've been able to kind of bring together um, new people that have moved to our community with the lifelong residents of our community. Uh, that's been a really um, important thing for me as the Burgess uh, to do over the last 12 years to try to create activities and events and community oriented activities that bring people together and create that sense of community and I think we've been successful in doing that. Uh, if I had to sum up our town in one word I would say it's probably dynamic. There are a lot of things happening especially this year with uh, Streetscape, but we have a growing economy. We have uh, thriving businesses, new businesses coming in, and uh, we, we feel very um, positive about the direction of our town. Um, economically, I think we've done a very good job of promoting our town. Our Main Street community has helped us do that. And uh, right now we have a very thriving and growing business community. Uh, we have a lot of organizations that help support that from a chamber all the way down to our Main Street group and of course the town of Middletown itself. Uh, so again, uh, if you want to do business in Middletown, it's a great place to be. What I'm most proud of Brunswick is that we're working together with a passion as we continue to grow by welcoming in new residents as well as making them feel at home. Brunswick's vibe is authentic. We are an outdoor town from the beginning with working on the railroad, the river, and on the farms in the past, and now in the present, we play on the river by fishing, kayaking, and tubing, as well as on the CNO Canal with biking, running, and hiking, and other trails. Brunswick remains authentically outdoors in spirit with being very hospitable, and we continue to have the small town charm. Business in Brunswick is always progressing with additions. The Brunswick Crossing retail space as well as the incoming hotel and downtown with Mini Dip Towpath Creamery and the Hive Bakery are just a few to mention. There's so much more in our small city. Emmitsburg, 24-7, 365, 1,500 Mount students, a $40 million Homeland Security facility, a basilica in a town of 2,900 wonderful people. We have over 500,000 visitors that come to our area. We're located in uh, friendly proximity to Gettysburg. Uh, we've had redone our whole streetscape downtown in New Square, and we're welcome businesses. If I was to sum up the vibe in one word, it's super califragilistic XP allergosis. Hi, I'm John Kinnaird, and I'm proud to say I'm the mayor of the town of Thurmont, the best community in northern Frederick County. Thurmont is a great little town. I've lived there since 1960. And one thing I can say about Thurmont is we still have that small town feel. Our population has grown over the last 50 years, but our population stays at a size that our residents enjoy. A lot of activities we have in town. We have lots of parks. Uh, in town we have plenty of parks. We also have the federal and state parks at our doorstep. We're surrounded by beautiful uh, farmland, orchard land. Uh, our residents have lots to do in the town of Thurmont on, on evenings and weekdays. If there's one word that sums up Thurmont, I would say it's laid back. We are a quiet town. Uh, we look at life a little bit differently. If there's an issue in town with a resident, everybody chips in and helps out. But overall, we're a very laid back community. Our businesses, as with most small towns, have seen issues over the last 20 or 30 years. 
but our downtown remains a strong focal point for, the, for Thermont and our Main Street corridor. So our business is doing very well in the town of Thermont. The town of Walkersville is very proud that we still maintain a small town community character, but we're meeting the needs of our current residents. We've got a great park system, great schools, and a brand new Frederick County Library. The businesses in Walkersville are very welcoming, and if I had to describe business in one word, I would say Walkersville is very hometown -oriented.